Yeah. Hey, everybody. Happy hump day. Hump day! Okay, he hasn't done that in a while. I think you broke an eardrum. Oh, my goodness. Okay, so Mark <laughs> is full of it. Yes, we're going a little bit crazy in quarantine here. So um, as you guys are coming on, please say hello. Let us know where you're watching from. We'd like to see um, where you guys are coming from and also know we're not on here by ourselves. If you are catching the replay, drop hashtag replay. We are coming to you guys from Pool, California. We being Mark. I'm Renee. <laughs> Mark. I'm in the doghouse. Yes, he is. He played a catch-up trick on me. So I am Renee. I'm Mark. We are hashtag Team Terry. If you guys are new, please drop new in the comments. We are so glad that you guys found us. Welcome. And if you're not following us already, please make sure that you are following us. Tap my nose. Three dots up here at the top and select follow because you're going to want to follow us for all things keto so it is oh and share share this out guys sharing is caring so hit that share button and also comment that you shared so i can give you a full name shout out and thank you for it i'm going to hand it over because it's getting hot right here by the stove just to be perfectly honest i'm going to hand it over to mark and thank you guys for saying hello hey dina hey paula hey peggy i'm going to go share hey Teresa from south georgia Okay, so we're going to make a uh, quick skillet side dish. This is a uh, uh, broccoli uh, bake. So also you can check us out on our YouTube page, Team Terry Keto. Uh, Team Terry is one word, the teaser capital. We've got uh, 83 videos over there. Um, <clears throat> we uh, just passed uh, a thousand subscribers. Thank you all very much for subscribing. Yes. Um, we're constantly putting new content on there so that we can uh, keep you keep you going in your keto journey. So this is going to be real quick. Um, it doesn't take much. I put a tablespoon of butter in my uh, cast iron skillet. I have put a tablespoon of avocado oil. The recipe calls for olive oil. I just happen to have avocado oil here, so I'm using that. Um, we're going to heat this up, melt it down. We're going to throw in a head of uh, uh, broccoli uh, floret and then uh, some salt and pepper. And we're going to brad just cook them for a couple of minutes, four or five minutes, just to get them to a nice uh, green color. And then uh, we're going to add some other ingredients and we'll put it in the oven and we're going to bake it in the oven. Say how long to bake it um, at 375. So I've got my butter melted. We're going to put in our uh, broccoli, which I probably should have cut this down a little bit smaller. Yeah, those aren't. We're going to have uh, big. Right. It's going to get tender, and then we can share it. Yeah. Or share it. We can. Um, then we can cut it. Cut yeah. it. <laughs> so um, I'm just going to put that in for a minute, or for four or five minutes timer on this just so I don't overcook it. Yes, thank you guys for as you are coming on and also thank you for sharing. Hey Carol, how are you doing? Hey Nancy, hey Gloria, hey Andrea, hey Jean. I hope you guys are all having an amazing week. Um, it is definitely I think what we're probably on like day 2000 of um, <laughs> shelter that. in place. It seems like it. We are coming up with new ways to keep ourselves entertained and sane without eating all the time catch up on your hands yes if you guys are follow us on TikTok, mark is doing science experiments matter of fact i'll put that in our story so you guys can see that um yeah he's doing science experiments on me and yeah anyway he's an ass but you'll have to watch the video to know what i'm talking about i'll post it whenever we get off of here in our stories so make sure that you're following us so you can go um and see that also, if you're not following us on TikTok, we have a lot of fun over there. I don't yes. know. I know we're old people on TikTok. I will, like, say that. But it is a lot of fun. That's, that's, that's what we've been doing. We have been playing on TikTok in quarantine. Yes, we are staying safe, Maureen. I hope you are, too. Kelly, love broccoli soy. Yeah, and so, you know, I'm going to put this. I didn't share it to the Cast Iron Skillet group. I should because, you guys, this is a great... Um, yeah, this is just, you're just going to heat it up, you're going to melt, put some garlic and cheese on it, put it in the oven, melt the cheese, and you're done. Um, this will go really good with chicken, uh, fish, uh, beef, pork, pretty much anything. It'll be a really nice side dish. Yes, cook it in the oven, be done with it. 
Um, I think we're going to make up some ribs after yeah. we get done in the Instapot. That is like amazing yeah. too. I don't know if you guys do ribs in the Instapot. But see, Joellen says never too old. Hey, Karen, thank you for jumping on. Peggy, I can't get on your YouTube. Oh, okay. You know what, you guys? If you can't get on the YouTube, just drop, drop YouTube, YouTube in the comment yeah. and I will put you over Sends there. Yeah. And then I saw somebody ask for the cornbread if we could repost it. Um, I'm yeah, thinking it's in about. YouTube. Yeah, it's in yeah. YouTube. But maybe I can try to copy it and send it to her. She's having a hard time getting on the YouTube, which is she's having a hard time getting on YouTube, not uh, on our page. Yeah. So, yes, I will see if I can get you that because, I mean, oh, the cornbread's amazing. Yes, it's a really good one. So, yes, drop YouTube, you guys, in the comments, and I will get you over there. And like Mark said, we hit 1,000 subscribers. Yes. We've not even been doing this. I mean, well, we've got 80-something recipes over there. Um, so we really appreciate all of your guys' support. I mean, absolutely amazing. And if you go over there, everything's in folders. Yes. So if you're looking for fat bombs, somebody was looking for the maple almond yep. fat bomb, you go to the folder and it That's has right. all of the fat bombs, which the cinnamon bun, by the way, guys, is my favorite. Um, so put two, uh, two cloves of garlic in here. And I'm just gonna give this quick stir just to get it all mixed with the, with the broccoli. And then we're going to add the rest of our ingredients. I've got uh, a half a cup of heavy whipping cream. Um, we're going to put that in here. I'm going to turn my heat off because now I'm just going to mix this stuff all around in here. I've got a uh, quarter cup of uh, Parmesan cheese. We're going to add that in here. Ooh, it looks yummy. Yes, you guys, it looks And then like a cup of mozzarella cheese. So I will post this recipe up in the top for you guys with the instructions of how, what temperature for the oven. Um, like Mark said, I think yeah. the broccoli could have been chopped a little bit thinner, finer, yeah. but yeah, it's, all right. it's, it's restaurant little... style. Yeah. And it's going to be baked too, so it's going to be amazing. If you guys are wanting more recipes besides YouTube and us, um, drop recipes, actually drop group in the comments, and I will get you into our group. Um, and it has like a lot of support, it has exercise videos, it has great recipes, it has vegan recipes, it has um, anything you can think of in there. So and drop that. And then I'm just going to top it with a little bit of red, pepper. red peppers. And then we're going to put this in the oven. You want to open that? Oh, yeah. You got your hand on it? I was leaning. Oh, yum. And we're going to set that for five minutes or just up. Yeah, we still have 15 seconds, but that's okay. We're going to set that for 10 minutes. We're going to let that all, let the cheese all melt, and then uh, we'll be ready to eat. Oh, so that's it. Absolutely amazing. Did you put garlic in there? Yes, I, no, I didn't. Oh, okay. No. Oh, yeah, I did. Oh, okay. I, the two cloves and mince I couldn't garlic. smell the garlic. You guys can tell that my nose is, like, not doing really well. It's spring over here. It was really warm over here today. So I see the comments for the group. I saw the comments for the YouTube. If you guys are getting value from this, if you could drop value in the comments, hit that love button and give it a quick share out. Also, put that you shared. We really appreciate you guys. Yes. Um, we are going to do, yeah. We're gonna do ribs in the Instapot. If you guys have ever done that, uh, it's the first it's time so we- It's so quick and so easy. First it's time just, we did it was what, a week ago? A week ago, yeah. They I were mean, delicious. Mind blown how tender and how they are. So maybe we will do something like that for you guys soon, show you, do you have I've a pudding recipe? I've got a new dry rib. I wanna, use, I wanna uh, try. So Trish, I'm so glad that you brought that up. You guys are gonna to wanna to make sure that you are following us, okay? Make sure that you're following us or you send us a friend request we are probably about five days away from um, launching, launching yeah. our website. And on our website, it will have all of our recipes also, and it will have them all categorized under breakfast, under appetizers, under desserts. And there is a print button because yes. I know that that is something you guys have asked for for a long time. And we both work full time, so this has been something that's taken us a while to do. To get together, yeah. So yes, we will announce that on here within the next week, week that that's two. live, and then all of our recipes will be over there. And all you have to do is hit 
Hit print. the print button and it gives you all the ingredients and the uh, instructions on how to make it. I'm not gonna lie, I'm kind of um, excited about that because yeah. when I print things out now, I have to print it from like a from photo. From whatever recipe we find. Yeah, yeah, and it's just a little bit crazy. So anyway, we appreciate all of you guys coming on. How long did it take you to lose weight? I've been, well, I've lost 50 pounds in well, I've, lost I've it kept like it off. I months. lost it in about probably six or seven months. I've kept it off now for close to a year. Yeah. So I'm so I'm hovering right around uh, 200 pounds, which is 50 pounds from where I started. Yeah, and that was a great question because you said something about water weight. The comments are going, but I'm going to tell you, stay off a scale. Yep. Don't get on the Don't scale. Don't get on a scale. Measure and take photos, you guys. And then yes. go by how you feel, how your clothes fit. How your clothes fit, the big one. The scale lies and yeah. the scale sabotages your brain. You quit eating keto. You quit doing all the beneficial things because the scale doesn't move. Yeah. But, I mean, you look in the mirror and you look amazing. So, anyway, yeah. enough of my um, rant about yeah. the scale. So, I really... Um, I see all of your guys' comments. Chocolate cake, Mark De did make me a really good German chocolate cake. Oh, um, yeah. that was we'll really have good. to look for that recipe too. Yeah. So make sure you guys are following us. Drop value and YouTube in the comments for us, and we will get you added. We'll get you the a link. Have an amazing week. Um, love and appreciate all of you guys. Thanks for spending some time with us. <laughs> Bye.